California lawmakers today rejected a measure that would make human trafficking of a child a serious felony. Experts say right now those convicted of trafficking people under the age of 17 are able to get out of prison early and serve much less time than what they're sentenced to. Case Area 3 Capital Correspondent Ashley Zavala explains both sides of this issue and why the lawmaker who wrote this bill was shocked by the vote today. California lawmakers in the Assembly Public Safety Committee today blocked a bill that would have defined human trafficking of a child a serious felony. This would have made it a strikeable offense, meaning it could put people convicted of trafficking children away for longer if they are convicted of trafficking them again. Right now, those convicted are eligible for early release credits, meaning their sentences can be significantly reduced. Supporters say this measure would have changed that. But opponents say more prison time doesn't get to the root of the problem and say there are already laws on the books that can put traffickers away for a significant amount of time. This bill was halfway through the legislative process. It passed unanimously through the state Senate with broad bipartisan support. State Senator Shannon Grove, who authored the bill, told us she was blindsided by today's vote. You can um, pass a note to a bank um, and rob a bank. You can commit arson, and that's considered a serious felony. But to traffic a minor child in the state of California is not, that's something wrong. I mean, I'm talking zero to 17 where the average age is 10 and they would not pass this bill. Now the vote tally was two to zero. No Democrats were willing to vote for this bill and those two votes came from Republicans. This bill is not dead. It's just not moving forward for the rest of the year. Discussions on this at the state capitol can pick up next year. Reporting at the state capitol, Ashley Zavala, KCRA 3 News. Well, if you may have noticed, the Assembly Public Safety Committee is known for blocking measures that would increase prison time, recently rejecting similar measures for fentanyl dealers and domestic violence offenders. The chairman of the committee, Assemblyman Reggie Jones-Sawyer, has promised to work with Senator Grove on this human trafficking bill.